Oh, guess we're gonna go this way. Maybe this way. Or I'll just shoot this Monaco now. Oops. Nice shot. Get 50. Suck it. Maybe I should try to move something again. Great puzzles, aren't they fun? <laughs> Go to the room past the stairs. Guess I gotta. Oh, hey, it's the little kids. You, you're those kids. The kids who were on TV. Oh, man. I'm famous. I'd autograph your back anytime. <laughs> I can only write using a chisel, but if you don't mind that, I can sign your back, too. We accept presents as well. I'm always in the mood for sweets. However, salty flavors are no good. Those disgusting tastes are never worth putting in your mouth. Mm, I want to drive a train someday, but can't. I want to go inside a chimney. Press a square button. This is what I gave me. My special subject was PE, so they called me Lil Ultimate PE. I'm the PE king who can do every exercise ever. Running non stop 24 7, 365 is easy as pie. Oh, I almost forgot. My job in the Warriors of Hope is the hero. And as hero and the leader, I'm gonna be the new ruler of this town. Always give 100%. My favorite class was gym, so they called me Lil Ultimate PE. Aha! A hero, the leader, and the Lil Ultimate PE. I even impressed myself. Pat on the back. You're far too boastful to be a leader. A true leader is calm and dignified. But I am the leader. We all agreed on it. All he did was win rock, paper, scissors. Doesn't matter. It's legally binding. I'm still the leader. I won, so I'm the leader. The leader! Fine, fine. You're the leader. Now, allow me to introduce myself. I am the sage, Nagisa Shingetsu. I am the vice leader of sorts. My name is Nagisa Shingetsu. In the Warriors of Hope, I act as the vice leader and sage. When I attended elementary school, I was known as Little Ultimate Social Studies. All right. <laughs> of course, social studies is but one area of my expertise. I excel at all scholarly pursuits. I was labeled Little Ultimate Social Studies because I was raised to be among society's elite. And I suppose I am a babysitter of sorts for the Warriors of Hope, Monica excluded. During my time at Hope's Peak Elementary, I was known as Little Ultimate Social Studies. Huh? Hope's Peak? You mean... that Hope's Peak? Hmm? Why should that surprise you? I... I, I didn't know there was an elementary school affiliated with the Academy. 
<laughs> Such an ignorant woman. Anyway, who's next? Perhaps Jotaro? Uh, wait. Before I go, can I practice introducing myself? Um, what was I gonna say? Uh, I'm the priest, Jotaro Kamori. You know how when you stare into moving bicycle spokes, you get all scared? Not particularly. Like, for some reason, you imagine how painful it would be to put your hand in. Oh, um, my name is Jachiro Kamuri, and bird skin isn't yummy no matter how you cook it. Words of advice? I was really good at arts and crafts, so they called me Little Ultimate Art. If it's arts and crafts, leave it to me. I can remove nails and varnish and things. And things. I do the priest thing for the Warriors of Hope. Oh, and also, I wonder if aliens exist. Cool fact. And you specialize in arts and crafts, making you little ultimate art, correct? Moving on. Uh, you said what I was gonna say. The whole thing. Oh, my chest itches. I wish I could scratch it raw, reach inside and scrape my nails on it. Your speeches are always too long. It's like how an elephant's nose is so long. But then again, giraffe necks are long too. And also waiting for a plane takes too long, and spring break is too long. Whoa, spring break is not too long, come on. Uh, um... Well, anyway, don't worry about Jatero. He's a latchkey kid. It made him a bit mental. Don't know what that means. It's not that I dislike latchkey kids, though. Some kids say they have magical powers. Isn't that awesome? You might get caught inside a magical parallel universe. Oh, sorry for the late introduction. My name's Katoko Utsugi, and I play the role of fighter. Ahoy, a girl! My name is Katoko Utsugi, and I play the fighter in the Warriors of Hope. You might think the fighter would be a boy, but nope, I'm totally a girl. I love girly things and peeled chestnuts. If it's totally adorbs, I love it! Totally adorbs. And I was pampered as the little ultimate drama in elementary school. But who cares about that old stuff? I'm so happy to meet you. I was called little ultimate drama, but that was a long time ago, so I'll leave that part out. My favorite food is peeled chestnuts. My least favorite food is unpeeled chestnuts. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Aren't you surprised? They're both chestnuts. Uh, um, <laughs> and hey, did you know kangaroos can jump backwards? And, and, Fun facts. and believe it or not, snakes have ears. Ew! <laughs> yes, yes, that's all very nice. Our next introduction is Monica. Monica is a mate. I like her wheelchair is like powered, but it looks like she has like no remote control, so it's like oh, I'm just like magically making this move. Monica is called Monica. Monica's a mage in the Warriors of Hope. I was known as Loyal Ultimate Homeroom while I was in elementary school. <laughs> okay. You might think there are no ultimates and commons in a class like Homeroom, but there are. For me, my skill isn't really about uniting people. It's about getting them all to help me. Believe it or not, I bring together a lot of wonderful people. It would be nice if you could be a wonderful person for Monica too. And when I attended elementary school, I was called the Lil Ultimate Homeroom. I'm sure you're familiar with it, right? Homeroom? Monica just loves homeroom! The first 
first hour of the day when we can share our thoughts. And that is why, even in the Warriors of Hope, I'm the life of the party! <laughs> uh, but... You are familiar with the Warriors of Hope. N no The Warriors of Hope are heroes who save the world from demons. Isn't that amazing? We're a party of heroes that hunt down demons. But nobody really wants me in the group. And I'm the party leader, which makes me the number one king of this town. Uh... Um... You... You kids are just joking, right? With demons and kings. Joking around? I mean, you guys are just kids, right? For a bunch of kids to be doing this kind of stuff... Just kids? Huh? You went and said it. Aw, that's the only thing I can say. Just aw. Since you're an about to be, we were thinking, well, doesn't matter. You're clearly a demon. Adults, children, the power structure remains the same. The subjects have merely been switched. With our Monokumas, you'll be nothing more than a squashed bug beneath our feet. Splattered like the sound of bloody chopped meat. Gross. <laughs> Intestines falling out of you like sausages. Gross. <laughs> oh, stop that, Jotaro. If you say it like that, she'll think we're joking. Huh? Our Monokumas? So the ones controlling those Monokumas out there are... That's right. Isn't it so cool? The Monokumas obey any order we give them. All thanks to Monica's magic. Yeah, that's our mage. She can use magic even without magic circles. <laughs> Thank you, everyone. You're so nice. Yeah! Monica's smile is so adorbs. Oh, I just want to smother you in syrup and eat you up. N no! Stop it! Stop! Stop! Which part? If what you're saying is true, please stop all of this. We will not. We will never stop until we've completed our paradise. Paradise? Oh, you didn't hear our address? A paradise made of children, by children, for children. We're gonna kill all the adults in this town and make a paradise just for kids. Isn't it awesome? No school or homework in paradise. Woohoo! Why must fireflies die so young? And since our paradise is for children only, there won't be any more pedophiles either. Good point. But can we keep the ice cream store? The ice cream didn't do anything wrong. What are you saying? What are you talking about? It doesn't make any sense! It doesn't have to make any sense! That's all! If Monica wants it, it happens! That's how it is! Uh-oh. Th this is bad. Monica's mad! It's going to be alright, Monica. Please, don't get upset. It's all going according to plan. That's right. If Monica says it, then white is black. Cats are dogs and, um... What else? 